private property disc. Yeah. So you can't walk on it. Why not? Why not? Yeah. It's, it's not public. It's open. Would you like me to shut the gate and I'll prove it to you? So welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're here in Wrexham taking a look at Ipsen. Ipsen. Now look how fantastic this building looks, eh? All the stone wall around the outside. It says innovation for patient care. Up there, we've won two fantastic awards. Careers website. We have a welcome reception or whatever it is over there. A lot of staff are on foot here. I don't know whether there's a car park nearby that they're walking to or what. But look at that. It stands out for sure. In this area, we've even got some sort of balcony at the top as well. I presume this is some sort of gatehouse security booth, but I'm not seeing anybody just yet. We even have these nice lights on the floor. It's unusual, isn't it? Leading you in to maybe the reception over there. Private Sorry, mate. Private property disc. Yeah. So you can't walk on here. Why not? Why not? Yeah. It's, it's not public. It's open. Would you like me to shut the gate and I'll prove it to you? No. Is there, is there a reception open to the public or anything for no. information? No. All oh, right. Okay. Is this the the Noro Science Centre of Excellence? The seventy-five million pound investment place. Is this not it's it? It's not Noro. No. Ipsen Biofarmers. Is that incorrect? Sorry, I can't read about my glasses. Ipsen's facility in Wrexham is recognised as a significant neuroscience centre of excellence. Oh, Neuro. Yeah, not what Noro. did I say? Noro. Okay. I'm not Neuro. expert in this field. All I'm doing, I'm making a video about the company and the building today. Take the drone around, let's get some footage. Yeah, that's fine. Put it on that's YouTube. Fine. Yeah, that's um, fine. If this, what's this um, real impact every day? Is that some sort of charity thing? No, it's a site thing. Oh, it's to do with Com sites. Internal yeah, sort internal, of communications. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So there really is nothing for the public, is there? It's just no. a place of work. That's it. Closed to the public. Yeah. No, don't close yeah. the gate. If they're left open, leave them open. Yeah. I'll, um... You know the rules. Ju just anyway. about here. You're happy for me to film from here, are you? Or where it changes I, colour there? Where your bike is fine. All it is, I just don't want you to get hit by a car or wagons, wagons coming in. That's fine. So, about here, yeah? Yeah, that's fine, mate. Yeah, thank you. So the sun is getting lower now, so it's getting a little bit difficult to film. But that looks quite decent, actually, doesn't it? With the, uh, the pipes popping up in the distance. Yeah, that looks quite a good shot. I like that. So I think this place has also been visited before. It must have been watching us. We've got a nice screen in there, look. Let's see what that says. SAP batch numbering is changing. It's going to be six digits now. Our business worldwide transformation program. So we've stood in the exact location where he wants us to stand and he gives us an amazing shot of all this internal information. But we don't want to know about batch numbering, do we? We want to see what this fantastic building looks like from above. So I think we'll just crack on with that. It does look fantastic from the outside. But we need David, don't we? To show us what this place looks like from above. So as always, we've checked on drone assist. There are no flight restrictions in the area at all. This world famous neuroscience center of excellence. The site has also been recognized as one of the UK's best workplaces in 2023 by the great place to work so let's go and have a look at it then shall we if you can hear a constant banging 
they do seem to be drilling some sort of pilings over to my left i will show you that with the drone as well this gopro Tinker. media mod seems to pick up the distant sounds home point updated so there it is and they are doing some sort of extension themselves down there with the foundations of that already in place so we'll just quickly show you what is happening over here the noise they're hammering down these concrete posts to form foundations of something being built there so let's just pull back a tiny bit and take in Ibsen it's that building just there which goes that far back and then this fantastic building just here the statement piece the building that surely people will come and look at and take photos of there it is can I just uh, ask a favour can you just stop landing by year because people do come out get lifts and everything just in case you land it and if anyone near did you say don't land it here well I don't mean land it when there's anyone around that's all just in case you hit someone by accident if your battery runs out or whatever alright mate uh, I, I, I'll do that anyway but yeah, yeah. I, I appreciate that you have to be concerned for staff yeah it's, no, no, well we're, we're here to protect the staff and property aren't we that's, yeah that's yeah. the reason I do it anyway mate I'd be yeah. silly if I harm people yeah it's just in case I don't know if battery fails or something like that and someone's underneath that's all do you know about drones? Yeah. Because they, they land themselves when the batteries yeah, are 20%. No. My son's got a, D, uh, got a DJ Phantom 3 yeah. or something like that. Look at that. That yeah, is fantastic. Yeah. Surely you get people here doing photography on that, don't you? We, we've got drones. No, I mean public. Members of the public come in to oh, get yeah, some footage. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 I'm not your first visitor, am I? Yeah. No. Are you being called in? Is he your boss? Yeah. Hopefully I've not got you into trouble, mate. So it's been called in by the boss. It sounded like he has certainly been visited before. But we were talking normally, weren't we? No need to be called in, overruled. But look at that terrace, that balcony area on the top. And the seats and the benches are ready. Yeah, absolutely fantastic. Someone's very lucky to work in that building, aren't they? Well, hopefully it's as nice inside as it looks on the outside. Solar panels, aircon. So much aircon, look at all that at the back. And of course, if they're involved in cutting edge science, then they will be very well looked after inside. So we've got this sort of link here. You can go through that road there, or is that a path? I'm not sure if that's a footpath or a road, but they've also linked it up just there as well. So it might be a recent uh, acquisition next door. Maybe originally they were just on this side and now they've sort of grabbed next door and linked them up. I don't know, I'm just guessing. Every time, uh, if I ask him for any more information, he might get told off again for talking to them. <laughs> anyway, let's get the whole site in one shot, do a 360 degree photo for Google Maps and move on. You do know that this aerial's on the outside, don't you? I'd class this as a, um, a potential trip hazard, health and safety here that I know it's sending a, a reading somewhere, but if, if your company have put it there, you might be liable for a trip. So it hasn't been too bad, has it? But of course he came out, he says, be careful around this area with the drone. His concern is for safety of staff. Well, what about the safety of the member of the public? Right that are out here and we've got things like this to start worrying about i mean it's on a magnet but look it's got a wire on it it could be a trip hazard 
you could trip up over that and is that anything to do with this company here i mean let's lift it up let's have a look exactly what is inside here you okay did, did you say something well it's a concern of mine so i'm taking ownership of the problem unless you want to i've reported this to you haven't i you heard me didn't you I can't do anything at the moment. No. And it's not fixed down, so it's not going to fall over. No, what it is, there's a cable here, and I've just said to you, it's a potential trip hazard. So if you want to take ownership of it... You've made it aware. Yeah, I'll talk to you. If you want to take ownership of it, then I don't need to. Okay. So, yes. so next time I come here, that's going to be out of the way, is it? Uh, well, we'll see. We'll, see. well, I can't have it as he is. I'm gonna lift the lid. No, you're not. Watch me. No. Well, assure me then, next time I come here, that's not gonna be visible. So, like I said, like I said, I'm gonna lift the lid and I'm gonna sort it out. Okay. Thank you. So, yeah, we don't really want to. to be noticing things that could be potential problems for other people and not resolving the problem. So let's put the gloves on and let's sort it out, shall we? So for evidence purposes, we've removed the manhole cover and we can see that that cable there leads to that. Whatever that is, which is obviously taking a, a reading from there and transmitting it I would have thought but leaving that out so close to a public footpath with a cable attached to it nah not good at all so we've got the evidence we'll put the cover back and we'll get that reported because he did not want to take ownership of that did he he could not assure me that at the earliest opportunity it will be fixed and removed. It's good to see that the data handler details are on display. If you do want a copy of any images that they've caught of you. But what's all this wire in here? It goes up, down, across. I've got wiring all over the place. And look at the fence line, how the fence is bowing. One of the old fire hydrants, here look, the Kennedy. You don't see them every day, do you? That is for sure. On the Ibsen grass internal verge area. And they do have electric vehicle charging luck. They like to use these parking signs, traffic cones with some special head to them. They like them so much that they even put them outside on the footpath. They're using our footpath to show their staff that the car park's full. Oh, he's taking it in now, look. He's not proud of putting his furniture, his litter, outside on our footpath and across the road with the porter cabin offices where we saw all the staff walking over to. That certainly is their car park. And there's something on the fence next to the Ipsen sign. So let's go and have a look at it, shall we? And this is it proposed new manufacturing facility. This is the consultation before applying. And that's what they, or the area, that they want to do it in. 
but you are too late and this is simply litter now left up on the fence completely pointless <laughs> And they do have some speed signs that are powered by solar panels and of course excellent CCTV. Hello! So that Ibsen building there and maybe this site as well combined they have announced a 75 million pound investment to mark its 50th anniversary research and development they say and they've spent so much on the place that when they repaired this fence they used an ethernet cable yes this is how they do things here at Ibsen look at that absolutely shocking they've even left the RJ45 connector on the end yes guys I said it nice and loud so you heard what do you think are you proud of your fence repair are these proud of it? Is that the image you want to portray to people coming to have a look at your site? Yes, that place looks very nice. But when you come across the road to your car park, you've got this. Come on. What is that all about? And they've got this littered on the floor as well. Children must not play on this site. I don't know. And if you was wondering whether that sign is anything to do with this fence, then there's your proof, an exact copy of the sign that is littered on the outside. And that completes the video from here at Ibsen. They spotted us immediately, didn't they? told us that we are not welcome on site. I asked him if he would take ownership of this trip hazardous here with the cable and he couldn't give us any promises. So we've got the evidence, we will report that. Report that to Love Clean Streets. And we'll leave these alone. We'll just quickly hide a DJ while it's queuing move on so I'm trying to hide the key ring and this camera is just following me so I'm finding it difficult to hide the key ring here so I'm gonna go over there and see what I can do so the camera is just over there somewhere yeah there it is look trying to see us the location of the DJ Audit's key ring is just down there. If you are one of the first people to watch the video and you do want a key ring, good luck with that. And that's it, we'll move on. So we'll leave that there. If you have enjoyed that video, do give it a thumbs up for me. And I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye for now.